In my childhood, in some midnight, I try to went out from my house and stay in front of the house. I want to say something. This happened especially in month of November. My parents also f***ed me. You know why? Every day, night time, I heard nice music in outside the house. When we waited for a while, that musical sound not only here, we could see something special. We could see, we could see something special. What special? Group of people having something decorated and illuminated come in front. Then the dance decorated elephant followed them. When they close to the place we were waiting, parent offered lot of things, including money. Not only my parents, many others did the same things. What is this event? It was the Katina ceremony day in the village temple. Every day, each temple during the whole month of November, we could see this event day by day. Even today, we can hear such sound when we stayed in monastery surrounding the village in the each temple day by day we can hear that sound because this is month of Katina Puja that is in temple village temple and city temple but in the forest monastery with different this puja, the Katina Puja. No any traditional music sound or uh, not walk around the village having a cutting drop event organized inside the monastery. Yes, this is the last month. This is the fourth month of the rain season. We call it Chiver month month of robes the meaning is month to be fine robes month to be fine robes this is according to the blessed one's advice almost all buddhist almost all buddhist buddhist people so happy and so busy with meritorious activities during this month during this month than the other month in the year. That's because cutting the puja. Few days ago, cutting the puja in our monastery held by the devotee. But due to the ethnic problems, devotee planned it to do very simply. So I have to tell the devotees about meaning and the benefits of the Katina Puja. Here I would like to share with you briefly what I taught them about this matter, this event. I explained them few things why devotees so much like to join for the Katina Puja. Why devotee so much like to join for the Katina Puja? What is the meaning of word Katina? Meaning of word Katina. How do we gain highest merit, highest merit from the offering? Why they give priority to the robe in this puja 
than other things. Benefits of the Puja I explain briefly for the devotee. Let's see now. Why devotees so much like to join for the Katina Puja? Puja, the offering is meritorious doors, meritorious doors, or we can say it as feel to earn merits, feel to earn merits. The doors to be earn merits. There are ten kinds of merits doors, merits fields, generosity, virtue, practice meditation, transferring merits, accepting merits, attending to the elders, uh, listening to the Dhamma, teaching Dhamma, um, also develop right view. Uh, there are such a good activities to do the merits activities to do earn the merits out of these ten kind of puja people so much interest to do cutting the puja because they know about effect of this effect of this the merits gained by the cutting the puja is higher than the other puja higher than the other puja why is it so powerful you can understand when you will know about the meaning of the word katina what is the meaning of word katina katina means hard strong or unbreakable hard strong or unbreakable so the effect given by this act also powerful. However, according to the scriptures, the katina is palivat and has three meaning. Three meaning: hard, firm, steps. Number one: hard, firm. Stick. Number two, the cotton cloth which is supplied by the lady, the devotee. Number three, wooden frame used in the ropes. But as there is How do we gain highest merit from the offering? There are a few qualities to be fulfilled for the accumulations of highest merit. Few qualities. Number one, the giver should be virtuous. The giver should be virtuous. Number two, the recipient should be virtuous. Number three, the things offered should be pure, that means not collected by illegally or any other bad way. The mind or the thought of the giver should be associated with faith and wisdom. That means knowing about come and its effect. When doing such good activities with full of faith and knowing the uh, good effect of this, that means the karma, effect of karma, such consciousness is wholesome and associate the mental factors, faith and wisdom. And 
Medvan is the mind should be wholesome in all the three times, all the three times. All the three times mean before the offering, before the offering, at the time of offering and after the offering. Keep this in your mind when you do the good things, call some activities before the events, while doing the events and after the events. All these three times, your mind should be pure. That means, should not contaminate, defile with attachment, or we can say as craving, and also with hatred, anger mind, and the delusion. And another one, the offering helps you gain highest merit, highest effect, if the gift is useful to the recipient, useful to the recipient. Keep all this in your mind, it will give big benefit for you because you are my friend, always doing good things. Therefore, very important for you is whatever activities, meritorious act, meritorious deed when, when you join, when you do, keep this in your mind, it's very important. Then the next one, why they give priority to the robe in this Kajina Puja? The Kajina Puja, why the devotee give priority to the robes? than the other things. There are so many things which can offer. But people always think about the robes. The robe is the uniform of all the Buddha and Arahant. So we call it as flag of Arahant. Because of this, people give priority to the offering robes that is one thing. Also, if we think about the historical background of the Katina, it's found in Mahavaka Pali, the Vinaya scriptures. The Blessed One proclaimed this month, the fourth month of the rainy season, as the month to be fine the robes. Very beginning. The monks had to find cloth themselves to make robes. But later on, when the devotee knew about the Blessed One's announcement, they took this opportunity to offer robes according to the Pali text. Offering suitable fabric to be make robes is the best way fabric, not the ready-made robes. It mentioned as Katina Dussa, Katina Dussa, Pali words. The meaning of these, Dussa is just cloth, material, clothing materials to be make robes. But nowadays, even the ready-made robes offer on Katina Day in some deep in some monastery by the devotees. Just think about the benefit of this puja. Here I want to add something more about why the cutting robes, cutting the puja is so powerful. As I explained above, the qualities of recipient qualities of given in the year then the all other times the rainy retreat season is very special for the monks as well as to the devotee because every year both of them 
thinking about more and plan about the rainy season what's a period what we should do how we organized this rainy retreat so as a monk they planned to determine the Lord Buddha's Varsa rule, rain season rules, and followed. Practice more and more meditation than the other times of the year. So, when we think about the recipient side, that the monks mentally the qualities of mental is so powerful than other times. That's why in the Dhamma book mentioned, especially in the commentaries, during those periods, in the ancient time, during the Lord Buddha's time, just after every rainy season, many monks and nuns become around. Full-time practice special meditation during this period. So the recipient side is powerful. And the devotees also on the date devotees gather to the monastery and invite to the monks to stay in the monastery and they promise to attend and supply for requisites during those periods. And not only the attending and supplying for requisites, they also practice than the other days. Listen to them and supporting also practice. So, in that way, the devotee also powerful in mind. Also, he had more faith and wisdoms about this period, these monks and the activities mindfully and with faith and wisdom they do this thing, they organize and therefore all those things will complete it. The result of the action is become more powerful than the other puja, other offering. That's why devotees so much like to do this thing. When we think about the benefit, we can illustrate it in many directions. The benefit to the recipient, the benefit to the giver, the benefit to the gods and past of relatives, the benefit to the with the sasana. This merits will give pleasant effect to the everyone who rejoices with this. Among these benefits, now let's see, think about the benefit to the giver. It's like the ocean, the benefit, the effect, the result, like the ocean. Huge, powerful. Unlimited. There are four things that need to all the beings. The four things are long life, fame, beauty, or handsome, physical appearance, and happiness, healthiness, healthiness. As the effect of merit, one will be born in good life with all above four. The Venerable Arant Nagita had all about his experience, told about his experience in front of the Blessed One. One of the previous lives, he has offered cardinal robes with other all requisites. As a result, since that life, he was never be he was never been born in woeful states. He was born in a heavenly world, eating kalpas. 
Kalpa means long, long period of time. 34 times he has become the king of the gods, the Sakka, King Sakka. Eight four times he has become universal monarch. He has born in human world in highest caste. And finally entered the order and attained arahantships. All this benefit was because he offered cardinal robes with great offering to the Buddha and the bhikkhus. Also he determined to be the arahant and attainment of Nibbana. Blessed and explain the special for benefits to the monks also. I think in this moment uh, I'm not going I'm not going to explain all those things. Uh, these benefits, the benefit for the giver, is important for you. According to these stories, Arahant, Venerable Arahant Nagita tell us previous act and effect. You can think about the merits, effect of merit. For your activities, your meritorious act. Whatever you determine, whatever you think, to gain those things, to give that result, positive result, pleasant result, can from these merits. You can gain as a result of these merits. Yes, this is very briefly what I asked to the devotees in the Katina Puja day. Uh, actually, I should remember all my good friends. Few years ago, always my Dhamma friends visited to Sri Lanka, to my small monastery, our small monastery, and support and join for this Puja and blood not only the cardinal ceremony they hold here they helps me and the venerable so i would like to share this merit what i collected by this event given dhamma sermon i would like to share with you by the power of this merit may you be healthy and happy always. May you all good wishes successful. All this merit may strong foundation to attain the top Nibbana. Sadhu, sadhu, sadhu.